Wisconsin Online has a simple and easy to use browsing function. However, how you access it is not very intuitive. In order to access it, you need to go to the Wisconsin Online main website page, go up to the top right hand side, and click on the link Learning Objects. When you click on the Learning Objects link, it takes you to the page that on the left side has the subjects that this repository covers. Now remember, this is a small repository, only a little over 2,000 resources, but almost all of them are very interactive by nature, and they're also high quality, and this repository houses its own materials, which means the integrity of those links is very good. You won't likely come across any broken links. I'm going to go ahead and click on Business. And you'll notice the subheadings that fall under Business. I'm going to go ahead and click on Accounting. You'll notice we found 16 objects in accounting. We could easily scroll through and view each of those. I'm going to go ahead and click on Cash Basis Accounting. You'll notice that the, um, the description, brief record, gives you the title and then a sentence explaining what the actual learning tutorial is focused on. I'm going to click on the view and it'll take me to the record. There is a little advertisement because they're trying to fund this endeavor. But if I scroll down, it will take us to the tutorial, and I'm not going to spend much time here, but I'll click on the very beginning. And some of these tutorials allow you to interact, type in answers, and get responses, and, um, and they are very good quality, good content, because they're developed by the faculty uh, who work with uh, Wisconsin Online. To learn more, check out my book, Interactive Open Educational Resources, and you'll find out everything you need to do to browse Wisconsin Online simply and easily.